welcome back in the kitchen one more time with Chef for Cutter cooking program guys today we want to show you how you can make yourself chicken and pasta in tomato sauce enjoy the recipe subscribe to the YouTube channel we got a lot more recipe coming out for you guys and remember get a copy of my cooking book on Amazon the price won't change it's your price and thank you so much for watching the video and leaving your comments visit my blog website at chefricardocooking.com see you next time bye bye so guys as you can see right here i have some diced chicken right here guys and right here so i have some garlic which i just chopped up tomato spring onion and white onion basically i want to make you a nice lovely chicken and pasta into tomato sauce really good and nice hopefully you like the recipe and subscribe to the youtube channel basically we're not going to use a lot of seasoning guys we normally know chef cut always using only thing we're going to do is going to simply put sprinkle a little bit of chicken season on top of it like that and also we're going to put on some white onion and a little bit of garlic that's one of the main things you need to do for your chicken that's fine you don't need to stress yourself i wonder where you're going to rub it up it's just chicken and pasta i'm making at the moment and this can go for kids kids do love this kind of recipe so hopefully you like the recipe subscribe to the youtube channel thank you so much for watching chef for cooking program we got a lot more recipe coming out for you thank you so much Basically, this is my fried pot right here for my chicken. Right over here, I'm cooking up some pasta right now at the moment. The pasta's all ready, so we need to get the crack on with the chicken in the meantime. So basically, what we're gonna simply do, we're just gonna pop a little bit of olive oil inside of the fried pan like this. I got on my fried pan, to be honest with you guys, we're for about three to four minutes now. So to be honest, this is really, really hot at the moment. So if I simply do a thing like this, put on some garlic inside of it make the garlic fry up first inside of the oil and then a little bit of white onion the reason why I did it before because I want to fry up both the meat and the meat inside the salt take this up about a second the next thing we're going to do add the chicken Saute the chicken until it gets cooked for up about 3 to 4 minutes. After 5 6 minutes, the chicken will take because it's chicken breast and it's very easy to cook. Nice and lovely. As you can see, right here, I'm burning out the chicken. Looking lovely so far. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna add the rest of my seasoning tomato and some more sweet onion. One. Looking lovely so far guys. I don't know if you guys will love this recipe because it's just a simple little recipe I did, you know what I mean? You can have it at home with the children. I don't know the children will love it. So guys, open you love the recipe, subscribe to the YouTube channel and leave your comments. Very important. We're gonna put a some paprika, let's give it a little colour. Please put a paprika. So we're gonna just run out this after another five more minutes until it's like cooked and ready. Nice and lovely right here. This is ready now. As you can see, the chicken is cooked. Look, I just burst this into half. Let's do another one to show you. See, until you burn the chicken to half like that, you can see that it's cooked. It's very tender. Now you don't want to overcook your chicken too much because this is chicken breast and you get really tough. So guys, now what we're gonna simply do, as I said before, I got some pasta cooking. Right over there, we're gonna chew up the pasta and add it to it. But before we chew up the pasta, what we need to do, I have a bottle of bolognese sauce, and it is tomato, vegetarian can have it also. I'm gonna pour it straight inside of like this. This is the bolognese sauce. You can get this one at local shop supermarket. Give it a stir like this. 
chicken and pasta dish. I know kids love this one. Guys, really good. I know a lot of kids do love this one. So I'm just gonna make this cook for another five more minutes. Really nice. Make this cook for another five more minutes and then we're gonna add the pasta. Nice and lovely. So look at this guys. Lovely and nice. So what we're gonna simply do, we're gonna add that pasta to it. Just like that. Just I know it's a lot of pasta but that's fine. If any of these left over and you wanna bring it to work tomorrow, I'll tell you, you're welcome. So you're gonna mix it up like this. And also, there's another way you can do it. You can put cheese on it, put it in the oven, and bake it also. Look at that, that is just lovely and nice. So we're just gonna make this a uh, cook for another five more minutes, and that's it. And I'm gonna size eight. This is lovely and nice guys. Chicken and pasta. Really good. And I know kids love this kind of dishes. So guys, enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the YouTube channel and leave your comments down. This is finished, we're gonna share it up if you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. Nice and lovely. Guys, look at this now, I'm just gonna share it out. But you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. This is beautiful guys chicken and pasta you can put a little bit of cheese on top of it if you do like but i'm not a fan of cheese so much you know what i mean but i know you guys can enjoy this lovely lovely chicken and pasta recipe from chef ricardo got a lot more recipe like this leave to come i know kids love kind of love this kind of recipe so hopefully you will enjoy the recipe and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching Chef for Color Cooking Program, guys. We have a lot more recipe like this for you.